I literally just finished watching Return of Jafar. I changed my shirt, took a sandwich break, topped off my wine. And now we're doing this again. Welcome back to Movie Munchies. I'm Alexis. If you've never been here before, we watch things and we eat them. Today we're doing Aladdin and the King of Thieves. This is part of what I'm hoping will be my Disney sequel series. None of these Disney sequel films will be getting cakes. None of them will be getting munchies and crunchies, but I will be rating each one of them on a curve from one to five cupcakes. After a certain point, the idea is that the highest scoring Disney sequel will get cupcakes. Listen, I've been wanting to watch this movie for so long now. And this was how it was way back when too, back when in the day when we caught Netflix movies in the mail. And there was apparently only one copy of The King of Thieves floating around. It took for like months, literal months, that movie was on our list and it took forever to get to our house. But one Saturday morning, my sister came and woke me up and she was like aloud and came in the mail. And I was like, yeah. I was so excited. I'm so excited to watch it again now. Um, of the two Aladdin sequels, I already know this one's my favorite. We'll see what score I give it. But let's just go ahead and get into it. Initiate entertainment. Rather than remove this content, we want to acknowledge its harmful impact, learn from it, and spark conversation to create a more Ill inclusive future. Oh, sh I'm still too slow. Oh, oh my god, I'm so excited. Oh yeah, that's right, it starts with his daddy. Um, Kasim is his dad's name? Bro. Bro. Aladdin's a good looking man, and we know why. Oh! Robin Williams is back, hallelujah! Our princess is to wed. Poor Razul over here, just staying bitter because Aladdin has to be around 24-7. Still really flat animation, made for TV film here. Oh yeah, song right out the gate. They're finally getting married, even though they pretended to do that in the first movie at the end. Don't smack talk Aladdin. Everybody's happy. What could possibly, possibly go wrong? wrong? Don't say that. He just jinxed everybody. While they're all munching. Oh, and his I voice is ooh. A small disturbance. I'll sneak up from behind. Kasim. Pretty sure that's his name. We gotta figure out what kind of texture or flavor he is. We decided that Iago <laughs> is a wet cracker. But there's something missing. Yes, aha! <sighs> Where's Where is the groom? The <sighs> Reminiscing. He finally has shoes, that's right. It's a bachelor party. Oh no. <laughs> Genie. Uh, you, he's not coming to the wedding. He died a long time ago. That is like a crying shame when you know that he's alive. Maybe if I did, I'd feel ready for this. Aww. I'm glad they did this because they don't give it enough attention. What do I know about families? Genie. Right, you're just getting married, you ain't having a baby yet. I suppose he's got a wife to take care of, though. He grown me in. And the party's all for me. And Jasmine. I never ever had a real true friend. Someone, Someone who, who could, could just, just understand, understand me. me. Hey, come on, Aladdin! This is not just gonna end! I'm a Yago. They need to stop being so f romantic. Like, just be cool. Like, y'all were just cool in the first movie. Like, you can't still be cool. Like, chill. Bros. Party You remember the, uh, the trailer for this movie? How they put in the little, this part. Ooh, genie. <laughs> chill out, bruh. And this movie gets its own score. The other one took straight. Oh! Bro, I forgot about this guy! 
I had a little figurine of him. It was probably from McDonald's or something. Yo, I remember. What's his name? God. <laughs> I remember him though, bro. I I forgot that he existed, but I remember him now. And who's this coming on the lovely stretch camel? Oh, it's Cleopatra. <laughs> and, and Caesar, and, and they're, they're bringing, bringing a, a salad. salad. How wonderful. Oh, look, there's Osiris. Oh, oh, oh Osiris. Osiris. <laughs> he be having too much fun, just on his own. And your name is? Thor. Thor. You're Thor? Well, it hurts. <laughs> It's everywhere. Get used to it. <laughs> I said Genie was like a chemical reaction. And I mentioned Pop Rocks. But also like baking soda or just like Mentos and Coke, you know? That's what Genie is. A lot. At one time. At all times. A royal wedding. Would that be fun to go to? I was about to say that would be fun to go to. It'd be an experience for sure, but would it be fun? A royal wedding? Be extravagant as hell, I'm sure. As you can see, I've never been. Don't look so sorry, boy. <laughs> Him and his pappy-in-law. With the peacocks. That's our aminom. Aw, she looks so pretty. Wow. Well. So regal, walking down the aisle like, yeah, I know I look good. Their security system be lacking around this palace. Like in the last movie, Abysmal was able to just rope his way over the wall. Like what the f And these guys just walked right in. Oh. Rude. Poor carpet. Just be getting trampled. People blowing their noses into them. Them be getting unraveled and shattered to pieces. Like, damn, he go through it. I thought the earth wasn't supposed to move until the honeymoon. <gasps> <laughs> oh my god! Pause, though, for real, cause you know Aladdin and Jasmine. You know they be getting it. You know, earth shaking. <laughs> Holy Jesus. Forgive me. <laughs> what a way to ruin a party. Well, they trampled the carpet. That's a little redundant. So this isn't a bad day for you, really, is it? Stop. Leave carpet alone. Carpet. Poor carpet. Not enough respect in this world. <laughs> the 40 thieves are kind of fun, though. Not gonna lie. I understand why they have the warning at the beginning. Say cracker and I let you have it on principle. Yeah, go have some spirit. Oh. <laughs> I was gonna say spirit. You took the word right out of my mouth, bro. They just be standing there letting people steal from them. Get him, Aladdin. That's kind of weak. I need you to try harder, bro. They fight like demons. I had a coworker. <laughs> I used to work in an office that was very heavy on testosterone. There were a lot of men around. And at one point, I was the only female in the room. So there were a lot of testosterone heavy conversations. There was one conversation. <laughs> they were talking about fighting. One of my coworkers was like, the best way to stump somebody in a fight is to just strip down naked. <laughs> just... Just in the minute, just throw all your clothes off and they'll be so confused. <laughs> He's like, well, what are you going to do after that? Like, what are they going to do? They'll be so confused. What are they just going to fight you? Like, <laughs> I'm, a <laughs> I'm not going to try that, <laughs> but that would be funny. <laughs> really? I get 39. 40. Ooh, chills. I love that moment. 40. With the music in the background. I don't even know it's his pappy. <laughs> Get him, girl. Was for ruining my wedding. She's in the cool Disney female squad. <laughs> <laughs> Little Abu with his sword. They just be letting him go ham on whoever. Be breaking the fourth wall. Did he do that in the other two movies? Probably not as much as in this one. Kasim said nothing about facing the powers of a genie. 
All this time he been up there blocking the ceiling from falling. He could have intimidated them a long time ago. Oh, where'd he get in there? I missed it. Damn, that's a mad pachyderm. Smooth. Like father, like son. I want to see some resumes on these guys. <laughs> and don't let the one with the beak near any power tool. Genie could literally snap his fingers and that place would be fixed back up in half a second. What were they after? The gifts? I like she ain't even mad. Oh, I forgot about this. Oh, sure. She warns him about the one question thing. There's literally one, two, three, four, five, six of them. And only two of them don't really talk. My father is alive? It's gotta be a gut dropper though. For real. How do you process that? Aladdin? Are you alright? What's wrong? Supported. I always wanted to know about my father, but- See, this is what I like about them. Pals. Showed me the world. They were very careful about how they animated her in this scene. This is the best she's gonna look in this whole movie. People like you don't come out of thin air. Aw, I like that. People like you don't come out of thin air. That's cute. You can what growing up <laughs> Little bean. If it means I'd have to go. I'll be right here when you I'll oh, be right here when you return. He's worried about leaving her. She's like, I'll be right here, baby. This is so precious. What the f Don't come out of this. What a sweet fog. Damn. Why do I forget so much? They're so supportive of one another. Look at how they're holding each other. I was so, so mad about it in the last movie, but in this one, it works better. Because it's not about them, that's why. In the last one, they were so dramatic and doing that, like, arguing over petty shit. And this one, they're just, I got you, boo. I'll be back in time for our wedding. I promise. Oh, oh man. It's much more subtle in this one, their love for each other. I mean, subtle's not the right word. But again, the last one was so over dramatized they were very loud and all their movements were like <gasps> <gasps> like they were in a stage play like what the f <laughs> open sesame open sesame for real we we is for real about that the story is much better on this one for sure let's move <laughs> Ooh, he was quick about that he was like up oh, they're in let's go Ooh. Ow. He would have broken his nose. In real life, for real. Nose broke. Whole face smashed, honestly. Face first. He face planted into that rock. How bad is it? <laughs> Fine, bruh. Come on. Why, why did he bring Iago with him, though? We needed somebody there for comedic relief. <laughs> A king's plan. This is what is this guy's name? Please tell me. I forgot. Nothing. This ought to be good. So Luke is. So Luke, thank you. Look at you. I thought I'd never see. Mirror images of one another. That's exactly what he's gonna look like when he old. When he a daddy. <laughs> he must die. <laughs> they must all. So Luke tastes like foil. Like when you when you accidentally have you ever accidentally bitten to some aluminum foil? Hmm? Huh? That's what the look tastes like. <laughs> Kill him. <laughs> or the boy could Yes. They are the boy exactly alike, I swear to god. Such an Aladdin thing <laughs> with people. Um Aladdin and Kasim, forgive me, but kind of give me Harry Potter and serious vibes. You know what I mean? Oh, the challenge is simple enough. Only one man survives. Jesus. You're my son. 
you'll be that man. Knock him dead. Um, dead. <laughs> and that's what I mean, because it's like already treating him like an adult. Because he never knew him as a child. He's like, you got it. Go on. It doesn't even know what he's capable of, honestly. What if he... <laughs> What if Aladdin was a string bean? <laughs> oh, he did fight him at the palace. That's right. Oh, Jesus. Now he's worried. This is dramatic. Look. You were the one who suggested it, brah. Like, well, I didn't think he would struggle so hard. Did you see? So Luke is twice his size, man. Like, that's not even fair. What did you expect was gonna happen? Like, of course he's gonna come out all right. Like, he's Aladdin, but you don't know him. You can't just assume. Damn. I'm mad, actually. That's not a good, that's not a good pappy thing to do. Mmm. <laughs> Has he killed folk before? They destroyed J uh, Jafar's lamp, I guess. Ooh. I like these kind of close-ups on his expressions without him saying much of anything. What did I say? Aladdin is both chewy and crispy. <laughs> I think it still stands. He should also be some kind of chili pepper. Nah, that doesn't sound quite right. Chewy and crispy, though. That's correct. You're in. You're in. And he just like, yeah. He's just kind of like, oh, you're my son. We're all good, right? Family like, yeah, now we can do this together. We can just go around stealing shit and be buds, be pals. But it's like, dad, I'm sorry. But did you forget that you done left me when I never knew who you were? Like, you don't know who I am. I had to raise myself. Shit. Like, where you been at? And you think I'm just going to walk up here and be like, dad. Like, he ain't got a life going on already. The f Does Kasim realize that Aladdin is the one that's supposed to be marrying the princess? He saw his face, didn't he? What the f <laughs> That's- no, no, take it back. No. Oh, she over here worrying about her man. She usually goes on the ventures with him. Why'd she stay behind? Well, I guess it is a father-son kind of thing. She doesn't need to be there. But why'd he take Iago, though? I can understand Abu, because, like, Abu's just been the one who's been there the entire time. And carpet is transportation, but why Iago? Also, she is the princess, I guess. Listen to they didn't Gina, stop her before, dear. though. Knows. You've got to get your <gasps> mind off this is this incessant waiting. Ugh! <laughs> uh. What is the cri the bassinet for? Matrimony, babies. Just because you're getting married, don't mean having a baby. Jeez. Okay, let's see. This will be the second wedding for both of you. <laughs> I'm thinking we need something a little more simple, a little more elegant. This will be the gray. second <laughs> wedding for both Did of you. Did it done on it. You, mob, teal, and salmon. What do you like, like besides like salmon? salmon. <laughs> okay, Madame. I, that is a line that I will randomly think about. It's just the middle of the day on like a, on like a, a Tuesday. Ain't nothing going on but me over here. I'm gonna throw some colors at your mom, teal and salmon. What do you like besides the salmon? <laughs> Why that one? I don't know. I don't know. Um, I don't remember the voice actor for Genie in Return of Jafar. I'm pretty sure it's the same guy that voices Homer Simpson. But his humor was so obnoxious and just too much. Robin Williams is so much better. Like, I'm actually laughing. These jokes are funny. And I'm not exhausted yet. He is still too much. <laughs> but the other movie, I was getting mad. That's right, Bing. How about this town? Is it wild you or You would what? never get tired, bored, or lonely with Genie around. I swear to God. You did your old man proud, Aladdin. I was just trying to stay alive. Yeah, he's mad now. I would be too. He's right for it. Kasim is some kind of leafy green. They can be good, but they's tough. Like kale or some sh**. Kale or like collards. <laughs> <laughs> Why? I don't know. It fits him though for some reason. I see it. I feel it. You don't know what it's like to have nothing. To stand up at the palace and know you deserve uh, Ooh. To be called street rat. 
Yes. We gotta pause. We gotta talk about this for a second. This man has not given a single thought, not a single thought, to what Aladdin is feeling about any of this. What he thinks about any of this. What he wants to do with any of this. He, Kasim is so laser focused on his own thing. He, how disrespectful. How disrespectful. You're going to go around here talking about you don't know what it's like to have nothing. Sir, you just met this fool. And do you, you left him. Have you even asked him what his life has been like since you left him? This is your son. You left him by himself. Well, with his mother. But he hasn't even stopped to quit. Like, how's your mom? Where's your mom at? She dead bro you left this child on his he had to fend for himself for years what i'm pissed the f off because he's got a pretty face and he's like his son in a lot of ways but god damn it not a single second has he thought about aladdin or how he feels he's just like oh fuck, i do have a son that's right well we can do this together then we're gonna go after this treasure you in or what and aladdin's like bro can we talk about the fact that you're my dad and I didn't even know that you were alive? You just been over here stealing from people. And I'm I was over here running out. I had to steal bread from folk. Like the only, I had a monkey. What? <laughs> I will sit here and rant about this all night. Let's continue. Ridiculous ridiculous. I am so disappointed in him right now. Do better, bro. Do better than that. I'm so pissed off. Yes. I do. And I'm glad that they, they're they showing that Aladdin is not... He's mad about this. Aladdin may never understand, but it just wouldn't work. I don't belong in his... Do you think he feels that way? He came from the streets too, bruh. He's your son. Damn. I hate that he goes back because he wants the f Oracle. Everything? He... Rusty as hell. We are talking about the wedding of your only son. It's a once in a You need to go back and learn how to be a dad. A good dad. How can I pass it out? Mm-mm. Mm-mm, I'm pissed the f*** off. I'm pissed the f*** off. I'll just sleep better knowing that he's off the streets and on the execution. Look at this dude's face. You're gonna listen to him and look at his face and trust him? Oh, no. It's a rock. You sweep dirt under it, you don't fly you on it. You sweep dirt under it, you don't fly on it. It's fun. I am not afraid. Now get off that thing before you break your neck. I trust Carver with my- Now you want to try to be a dad. Uh-uh. This is a grown-ass man over here. You have a genie? Have you used all three wishes yet? Bro. Uh, oh, please, don't go- God. God damn it. Because this is no my... low lives this time. Other than the parrot, of course. <laughs> Other than the parrot, of course. <laughs> Oh well. Uh, yeah, can we address the fact that Kasim was the one who came and crashed your wedding in the first place? Allow me to introduce uh, the King of Thieves. And he walked in there so confidently too. Like, oh yeah, Aladdin's my son. I can just walk right in here. You literally, bro. You literally crashed the wedding trying to steal from them. <laughs> Do not attempt to move, or we'll be shooting ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I need all of that again. When you're here, you're not the king of thieves. You're my dad. Mm, had more practice being the king of You sure the hell did, b I'm over here yelling. It's it's 2 17 a.m. My boy Aladdin must have been born under a lucky star to find such a treasure. You are most definitely most Aladdin's definitely father. Most definitely Aladdin's father. Talking like that. I try to block out the memories. Say Except not over here lying. Just like Aladdin. Just like Aladdin. All he needed was a second chance. It's a miracle. <sighs> you got cozy a little too quick. What's more important than sentencing my prisoners? Everything I presume. Aladdin? You didn't capture Aladdin with the others? Why would he be with the 40 thieves? Because his father is the king of thieves! Ooh, Saluk over here spilling 
all the tea and getting everybody in trouble. Drama, the drama. Where is he? Hakuna Matata. <laughs> Oh, it's having an out of movie experience. Here's the monkey's lock fix. Why would you choose to do this now? What is your problem, bro? Straight to the dungeon. Jesus. But we've been expecting you. Oh, Lord, have mercy. What? Why would. Why would you choose to do that at that moment? Golly. Huh? Russell is too happy. Too happy to do it. Now I know why you really came back. Mm, the betrayal. I thought I could change him. I had to try. Maybe. You can change my clothes. <laughs> you can't change my Maybe. Who I am. And the law is crystal clear on what we must now do. Mm. There are some wishes that even I can't make come true. She ain't a real bro and bestie. Come on, how you want to dress in the King of Thieves ensemble? But he's a not gonna lie, to a lot of me looking good in this outfit. Mm. <laughs> Hot damn. <laughs> the King of Thieves will make his most miraculous escape ever. Out of my life. It's the cave talking, isn't it? Hmm. They really need to sit down and talk. <laughs> they really that's what they needed to do in the first place. Honestly, they didn't sit down and talk and now we doing this now. And look where he is, right where his baby was, however long ago that was. That's what you get, Iago, honestly. Iago be causing all kinds of problems. Smooth like butter, like criminal undercover. <laughs> Even sounds like me. But he's better than you. He is. When the sun That's what he looks like without his turban on. Little people who <laughs> can't be. <laughs> be around with that would be say if I was Aladdin, I would spend so much of my time f***ing around with Rizzle. Gotcha. Ooh, snatched out of midair. Honey, uh, something must move. You were supposed to leave, bruh. He didn't want to do this with you. He didn't want to see you again, honestly. And I went... I, psh, I don't blame him. I'm sorry for what you lost. <laughs> but you can't go back now. You know that. But he what sure as can. I'm not going with you. He never was going to go with you. I won't do what he did. I won't run away. I never ran away from anything in my life. <laughs> you ran away from your family. I won't walk out on Jasmine. The drama lord. Um, if there's a punishment, I'll take it. So be it. We have Why the are oracle. You the treasure's just waiting for us. The oracle? It. I had nothing left to lose. Yes. <gasps> you sure as f did. Oh my god. Good luck, kid. That was... I felt it. That was a good fight. That was a good fight. Warranted. I would never cut my men out of the deal. They're my family. My only family. Bro! I can't... Ooh. Mm -mm. I can't hang with this man. No, sir. Just as confident as his son without any basis for being such. Like, shoving your foot in your mouth. It is tragic, your highness. Look, look at his face. I object, your honor. Bailiff. <laughs> because I'm crazy about this kid. <laughs> Genie, I can handle this myself. Sultan, I convinced my dad to you come. You done growing up. Your father. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh, oh, well, I guess that's true. <laughs> you did it out of love. And you came back to take responsibility for your actions. The perks of marrying the princess, bro. He ain't even married to her yet. I believe we have per See? Where <laughs> carpet. Oh. 
child! Dad! What? What happened to the quality? What happened? Just plummeted. Yo, we're rushing through the rest of this. Uh... That's his problem. <clears throat> he chose to go back to that life. He is your father. How can you do anything else? Sometimes you do not need toxic people in your life. This might have been one of those times, except that it's a Disney movie, so. But in real life, Kasim honestly, I don't know. They they would have needed to sit down and have a conversation before the decision was made. But if he was not willing to budge, then it would have been best for Aladdin to just be like, all right, you know what? I, I met you. I know that you're alive now and I'm grateful, but we really don't need to be a part of each other's lives. Because you just, you just stressful for me is all that that is. And you don't want to do right by nobody, including your own son. So I'm going to call it right here. It's been nice knowing you for the small amount of time that I did. <laughs> Not everybody brings positivity and good things into your life. And sometimes those people, unfortunately, are related to you. <laughs> you got to be able to discern whether or not they're good for you. Get in there, Jasmine. That's the right, girl. Genie, we need a distraction. Survey says. Genie is always a distraction, bruh. Genie is always a distraction without trying to be a distraction. It took me years to find my father. I'm not losing him again. To be honest, you weren't looking for him for years. You didn't even know he was alive until like what was a few days ago. How could I do anything else? Now let's get that treasure of yours. Sorry, but we can't forgive you that easily. We gotta sit down and talk for a while. Multiple times. We need to have several conversations to get all this fixed. Because this is trauma now. It's been trauma. But it's trauma that's on the surface at this point. <laughs> we were meant to do this together. I don't know about that. He's still obsessed. Still obsessed. You gotta get over it, bruh. Ooh. That moment. They do both have a thing for adventure. For sure, dog. Treasure hunting. They're exactly like in every way, except that Aladdin has a much sturdier moral center in regards to what's most important, you know? He will drop everything in a heartbeat for his lady, for his friends, but most especially for his woman. And what you gonna do with all that, hmm? What you gonna do with all the gold? So it's not just everything that it touches, but everything that's connected to everything that it touches? Time to go, it been time to go, fool. Damn. And that is what greed will do to you. Bro, that is what greed will do to you. Watch closely. This wretched thing almost cost me the ultimate treasure. Thank you. It's you, son. You. That took you the whole damn movie! I'm sorry it took me this long to realize it. I'm sorry too. The whole damn movie and his whole damn life. Jesus Christ. There they are. Just patiently waiting for her boo. What did I say? Just patiently waiting for her boo. That's what I meant to say. We have some unfinished business. And she is always the first thing on his mind. Don't you love it? God, I had such a problem with him in The Return of Jafar. But in this one, they're fine. They're more than fine. What was the difference? Yeah, why was it so drastic? Yes. <laughs> the Sultan is f***ing useless. Damn. All he does is bend the rules so that Aladdin can <laughs> be there. Raja has not been in this whole movie. I just realized that. Sure you don't need a rug? I assure you the pr Not with that picture. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Damn, I forgot about that. Hi stuff. Chill until you get back home, brah. That went by fast. Honestly, that was a significant leap from, ret from Return of Jafar. I'm not gonna lie, not gonna lie. 
Oh lord, what were they doing with the with Return of Jafar? Like, damn. This one was a big step up. I was thoroughly invested in the story, <laughs> in the drama. I was so invested in the drama to the point that I was over here cussing up a storm. Kasim with mm, Norm. You know, they be having some serious talks. I'm I'm gonna keep this outro short. I'm gonna give this one a four out of five cupcakes. Four out of five. The animation was still B tier, but it was definitely a step up from what it was in Return of Jafar. The story was much better. I was definitely invested in it, and it, I liked the drama. And I thought it was great to throw his daddy there into the mix, and they were exactly the same person, I swear to God. <laughs> Almost exactly the same person. Aladdin had a little bit of a head on his shoulders, but you know. Anyways, that's all she wrote, y'all. It was a joy to watch again. Make sure you subscribe, click notifications, leave a comment, please. What am I gonna ask you this time? What is your favorite Robin Williams movie? Put it down in the comments and for sure I will get to it. I will because I love me some Robin Williams morning, noon, and night. So tell me what your favorite movie is with him in it and I will watch it on this channel and do something for it. All right. Okay. Until next time. Bye.